Today, we are removing smoke odor from a rental vehicle. Today, Biohazard Pro is treating a vehicle for smoke odor. Uh, so we're gonna grab this ozone generator and um, we're gonna set it up in the vehicle and let it run um, in order to remove that odor. Contrary to a lot of misinformation on the internet and YouTube, an ozone shock treatment is not the only step you would take to remove cigarette odor from a vehicle. A lot of times um, people smoke in a vehicle and they do it repetitively and that smoke not only um, accumulates in a vehicle but the, anything porous such as the headliner will actually uh, accumulate tar as well. Um, so ozone doesn't get rid of the tar, it gets rid of the odor. Um, so, so you'd want to actually clean um, any porous materials with any special chemicals or, or hot water extraction um, to get the tar off and then dry it out and then uh, use ozone. But in this specific case, uh, the customer rented his vehicle out on one of the apps and someone smoked in it once um, and he got some smoke odor. So he called us to come in and only in this rare occasion would we only put an ozone machine in to get rid of the odor. If someone is smoking repetitively in a vehicle, um, you're gonna wanna clean the vehicle first. So as you can see here, uh, we're putting the air on and letting it circulate through. So when we run the gas, um, it's not only affecting the cabin of the vehicle, but it is circulating through the air system, which is important. This is my favorite part. You can literally see the ozone generator working. Like those electrode plates are converting oxygen, which is O2, into ozone, which is O3, and that's what's going to get rid of the odor. You just want to make sure that if you're in public, especially a public sidewalk, and you have cords or any equipment, you want to you're going to want to get that out of the way so nobody trips over it. Um, it prevents from getting other people hurt, uh, but also mitigates your liability. And that's pretty much it. All we're doing today is letting the machine run in the vehicle. And um, all I'm going to do is climb back in the rig, sit down and relax or make YouTube videos. Hey, let us know in the comments section what you thought of this video.